students now we will be looking at different types of carriers and we would be starting with the motor carriers motor carriers became attractive or were in use after when the when the first world war actually started so automobiles uh, started around world war 1 when converted automobiles were used for pick up and delivery in local areas so the first scenario in the history where motor vehicles were actually used as a carrier was around that first world war first world war mein aapke paas jo hai us 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 case mein ye automobiles ko convert kar diya gaya they were like pick up and delivery vans aur wo local area mein unko use kiya jata tha the interstate system of highways developed from the 1950s to 1991 usse pehle isliye important nahi tha because aapke paas jo road system tha that was not that developed wo bahut zyada koi ek achhi surat mein nahi tha so when it became attractive after 1950s your motor carriers become more and more frequent and more and more developed the motor carriers steadily replaced railroads as the mode of choice for freight transportation especially in the local or easily accessible geographical locations wahan par isne 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 rail system ko jo hai kyunki you could have some limitations with the rails yes rate could be lower but the thing is i might not have the rail road or the routing for some specific area to wahan par jab aapke paas highway systems ban gaye roads ban gayi to motor vehicles become a better mode of carrier it is actually a dominant mode of freight transportation today especially wahan par jahan par the cities and the towns and the county sides or the villages have been actually been linked through roads you cannot actually design the rail system which will be actually linking the villages or the towns or some small cities but you can actually design and what the countries do or the governments do they actually link these different villages towns and cities through the road system to road system jab aapke paas aaya to freight transportation mein it become actually the dominant part if you see this figure मोटर कैरियर से रिलेटेड है तो ट्रांसपोर्टेड बाय मोटर कैरियर्स इन 2012 ट्वेल्व दी स्टेटिस्टिक्स आर ऑफ कोर्स फ्रॉम द यू एस नाइन बिलियन टन एंड ऑफ द टोटल डोमेस्टिक मूवमेंट बाय द मोटर कैरियर्स इन 2012 ट्वेल्व इट वॉज एक्चुअली सिक्सटी परसेंट ऑफ द ओवरऑल डोमेस्टिक मूवमेंट यानी आपकी जो हंड्रेड परसेंट डोमेस्टिक मूवमेंट थी उसके अंदर से सिक्सटी था सिग्निफिकेंट आई वुड से द मेजर पार्ट then employed in the motor carrier industry in 2011 was actually 6.9 million people which were actually attached to the transportation through motor traveled by the motor carriers for business purposes in 2010 were like 398 billion miles approximately itna cover kiya gaya jab aap in statistics ko dekhte hain to it actually tell you ki motor vehicles or motor carriers they are a significant part especially for the local transportation or the easily accessible locations now what we would be doing we would be looking at different types of motor vehicles in our next session thank you